Thank you for joining us at the Washburn Review. I'm Brendan Williams, and we're at Washburn's own Lee Arena for the Sunflower State Games. Mitch Gross is the executive director of the Sunflower State Games and works every year, year-round, on the tournaments and other competitions. Uh, well, the Sunflower Games were started in 1990 and were modeled after the Olympics. Um, the event is for all Kansans, uh, all ages, and all skill levels. Specifically for basketball, we've had the event since its inception in 1990. Um, Basically, our tournament is for third graders through 12th graders. We've had many uh, Division I athletes uh, who, who played at the Sunflower State Games when they were in, in grade school and high school go on to, to play for some major colleges. Um, and then it's also interesting, too, because then those same, same uh, people come back and play in our adult tournament, which is held a week later. Overall, we have 49 different events. Um, our biggest events, other than basketball, are our youth baseball tournament. Um, and then we have many large individual sports such as track and field, swimming, martial arts, our 5K, 10K road race, cycling, and wrestling. And personally, what's your favorite sport to go watch in the Sunflower State Games? What do you think is the most competitive, most fun to watch? Um, you know, I don't know that I could just pick one. Uh, I, I, I have to remain unbiased because, uh, you know, I'm kind of uh, working with all 49 of our sport directors, but uh, you know, definitely basketball is up there because it's really our anchor event. You know, this year we're, we're hosting uh, 80 different youth teams. Um, the record was 110 three years ago, so um, it quite is a, a, its own event in itself. And how do you guys prepare for the Sunflower State Games other than, uh, of course, signing up all the coaches everything? How do you guys prepare for that? Well, actually, it's a, an entire year-long process. Um, as soon as the event ends, uh, we basically have September and October to start planning and doing evaluation from the previous summer. And it really is a year-long process, uh, going out and fundraising, uh, the marketing aspect, um, and then the promotions and, and actually uh, you know, getting the registrations. And then you have the event prep um, and volunteer recruitment. It, it really is a year-long process. Thank you for joining us at the Washburn Review for the Sunflower State Games. I'm Brendan Williams.